Welcome back to The Bible Says What? Today I will summarize Proverbs chapter 16, which contains 33 of Solomon's Proverbs. I will give you another sample of these because there are many Proverbs covering many different topics. Too many to cover here. Let me encourage you to read all the rest of them on your own. Solomon wrote, Everyone thinks their ways are clean and right, but it only leads to death. God sees the motives of every deed, and He will judge if something is righteous and good or not. Commit all of your ways to the Lord, and your plans will be established. God made everything for a purpose. He even made the wicked for the day of evil. Whoever is proud in the heart is disgusting in the eyes of the Lord. Pride goes before destruction, and a haughty spirit goes before a fall. Solomon continued, Man plans his ways, but God directs his steps. God is very concerned about correct balances and weights in business. The wicked cheater will face God's wrath. It is better to get wisdom than it is to get gold. It's better to have a humble spirit than to obtain great wealth. Whoever gives close attention to God's word will find good things, and the Lord will bless that person richly. A man's hunger works for him, and it will keep him from being lazy. A gray head of hair is a crown of glory, and it is found in the way of righteousness. Whoever is slow to anger is better in God's eyes than the mighty warrior. Whoever can rule over his spirit is better than a mighty general who captures a city. The most important verses in this chapter are Proverbs 16, 18, and 19, which state, Pride goeth before destruction, and a haughty spirit before a fall. Better it is to be of a humble spirit with the lowly, than to divide the spoil with the proud. The thing I think the Lord wants us to understand after reading this chapter is that everyone thinks their ways are acceptable and good, but God decides if that really is the case. God sees every person's motives for doing what they do. If we commit our ways to the Lord, our plans will be established. God made everything for a purpose, even the wicked person for the day of evil. God wants fairness and honesty in business transactions. Whoever studies God's word will find good things. And God wants us to know that he loves a humble spirit and wants everyone to have one. Would God consider you humble in spirit? Or would he consider you proud and arrogant? Why don't you surrender your life to him and just give up? Repent for your sin and turn to Jesus for salvation. Jesus humbled himself and died on a cross to pay for your sin, and the Father raised Jesus from the dead. God said that if you confess with your mouth the Lord Jesus, and if you believe in your heart that the Father raised Jesus from the dead, you would be saved. Why don't you do that right now? Thanks for watching the Proverbs chapter 16 episode. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and share it. Subscribe if you want to keep up with these daily videos too. See you next time.